is um, organized, very organized with the full assistance of our speakers. Uh, for me, it's very enriching. Why? Uh, because I've learned new many things, no? and uh, it's really very informative. I learned a lot from this workshop. Actually, from day one up to yesterday, I really learned a lot regarding the uh, how to handle our kids in terms of their performance or outcome. The work is, the workshop is very good. Um, the process is very smooth. Um, it is easy to follow. The, the instruction is precise. We had confusions, but with the help of the facilitators and the speakers, we were able to do the, our task. For the two-day seminar, uh, I would like to have it in, in three words. No? Uh, the first word is relationship. No? Uh, we need, uh, I need to be in relation with God, with God, with others, with the Mother Earth and the, our community and the global community. Second word is about integration. That in doing things in this world, especially as teachers, uh, it should be uh, interconnectedness no, with one another. And the third word is that the, the word is transformation. Transformation, why? Because as we approach the 21st century, there were so many innovations in terms of uh, in the education sector, in terms of teaching strategies. No? Uh, we teachers must um, implement a flexible classroom, a personalized learning, and immersed learning among our students. During the workshop, the challenges for us in the in our group, because we are, most of us are math teachers, so there's a difficulty in integrating uh, in the outcomes of the climate change because the, the math subject outcomes is precise. It, it is um, exact, like addition, subtraction, multiplication. So we simply integrate uh, the climate change to having environmental awareness in the activities. Um, it, it, it greatly helped us. The challenging part is we need to come up with three outputs and three assessments. For me, that was not easy because of the time constraint. In fairness to the speakers, uh, the speakers are really knowledgeable. They are really helpful during the process. So they, they, guide, uh, they guided us during the workshop. I have learned that using the integration of outcomes through the ILO, it helped us to assess uh, our students to, to achieve the global goals for sustainable development in terms of the climate change. In the formulation of the intended learning outcomes, we should always be guided with the Bloom's taxonomy. And of course, we have to keep it simple always um, so that it will be easier for the students to also apply it in the classroom and of course outside the classroom. So more or less this is a, a new discovery because it's a new way of integrating values no? and how do we to cascade the, how to cascade our value, our core values in the classroom instruction. In every seminar in, in general, um, each school is unique. Uh, we have our own system, we have our own policies. Uh, the, the good thing about this seminar is we can pick up the things that are doable in our school and then I can echo, I can, I can share it with my colleagues. We are doing everything in the classroom. We feed the mind, but sometimes we, for, uh, we forget to feed the heart which is the core of what we are doing as a teachers. No? The aim of this seminar uh, is really for to bring back the beauty of God's creation. Sabi nga ni Bishop Bakan on the first day is, let us make our students happy and let us make everyone happy. No? If we will be able to undergo or underwent this ecological conversion that the Pope Francis is calling each one of us.